Right now we're working on the complete story for Dead Rising and a quick cut Let's Play comedy about Dead Rising 3. But some new DLC for Dead Rising 3 just dropped, and honestly, it's pissed me off. Right now you can get a giant 13GB download for Dead Rising 3 that is to ensure compatibility for this DLC and all upcoming ones. Once you get it, you'll see a new menu option. Now here's the problem and the slight irritation. I bought the season pass expecting more of the game that I love. The problem is, this DLC does not support the co-op that I loved about the original game. You have to go through all of the story mode for the new DLC by yourself. Then all the stuff you've earned will carry over to your main game, allowing you to use it in co-op. The problem is, I bought the season pass when the game came out, and nowhere around the season pass did it state there would be no co-op. If I had known this, I probably wouldn't have downloaded it right away and jumped on trying to do it. We would have waited until Zotica Line needed to play it for the complete story script. So, you get a new story, new vehicles, new weapons, but no co-op. What do you think? Was it worth the wait for that, or are you upset about the lack of co-op support? And do you feel kind of cheated about the whole season pass situation? This whole thing could have been cleared up for me if they had simply stated in the season pass purchase, all future DLC will not support co-op. I would have known ahead of time what I was getting into, and I probably wouldn't have bought the season pass right away, or I would have at least knowing what I was going to get. Follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+, and leave your opinions and comments down below, please.